Welcome to this Alicad User Guide Tutorial 3 on more advanced drawings. In this tutorial, we will discuss the text function. This function allows you to insert text using either single line, multi line, or legacy text. If you've not already done so, check out our other tutorials. In this tutorial, we will place text arbitrarily but it is possible to position it using tools such as the arrow keys, snaps, coordinates or geometry. We will start with single line text. Before you insert text, it is important to create the textiles you would like to use by first going to Settings, Textiles and adding the unique styles that you require. Select Draw Text, single line text, and you'll be prompted to enter the text. Type in the required text, and press enter or click on the done icon. You'll now be prompted to indicate the text position. Before you insert the text, you can change the text style, height, angle or rotation, Alignment or insertion point or align to an existing entity. Once you've finished with your settings, click on the done icon, position the text and press enter or click to insert the text. To end the text function, press escape or click on the finished icon. To edit the text, you can double click on the text. You can now edit the text as required or change any of its properties. We will delete this text now. To delete text, select the text and then press delete. Select draw, text, multiline text and you will be prompted to indicate the top left corner of the multiline text box. Before you insert this corner, select the text style you would like to use, set the text height, the angle or rotation of the text the alignment or insertion point for the text, or align the text to an existing entity. Once you've finished with these settings, click the Done icon. Position the cursor where the multiline text box will be required and click or press Enter. You are now prompted to indicate the bottom right hand corner of the multiline text box. Drag the text box out and click or press Enter to insert the text box. The multiline editor opens. Here you can adjust the width of the text by going to the scroll bar and dragging it out or you can insert a measurement for the text box. Top in the required text. You can now edit the text. The fonts can be changed and different fonts may be used. The paragraphs can be tabbed or aligned using the various alignment options. You can also use various styles and the color of the text may also be changed. Text 
can be copied and pasted into the multi-line text editor and symbols are easily inserted by going to insert insert symbols and selecting the symbols if you click on other the character map will open and you can select the symbol that you require once you're finished click on OK to insert the text double click on the text to open the multi-line text editor to edit the text Click OK and press Delete to remove the text. To use Legacy Settings, select Settings, System Settings, Legacy Settings and check the Use Legacy Text Dim Entry option and click OK. Now select Draw, Text and you'll notice that the Single Line Text option is greyed out. Select the multi-line text option. You are prompted to position the text. Position the text and press enter or click. The text entry dialog appears. Type in the required text. And click OK to insert the text. Right click and select quit to end the text function or press escape. To edit the legacy text Double click on it and the text entry dialog reappears. This text cannot be edited as multi-line text can with different fonts, colors and alignments. If you change the color or the font, the whole text string will be changed. I hope you have enjoyed this tutorial. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Look out for our next tutorial and visit our website to find out more about Alicad.